out. Okay. Hey babes. So welcome back to the vlog channel. I am on my way to the chiropractor right now and I don't think I've ever been this excited for an appointment in my life. Um, I told Sam like I woke up this morning and my back is starting to feel better on its own so like this could not come at a more perfect time because I know that as soon as I see this chiropractor it's going to make me feel a lot better. Um, so I'm very ready for this. But hello. <laughs> I um, woke up a little bit late. I wanted to be productive today, and it's just, it ain't happened. Uh, well, okay, let me rephrase. It wasn't happening this morning, so it is what it is. But I have got to self-tan. Like, I completely forgot that that was a part of my plan today, and I woke up, and I couldn't figure out what was wrong and why my face looked so different and, like, why my skin looked so different when I was putting on my makeup, and I was like, oh, it's because I don't have any self-tanner on, and I'm not used to looking this pale in the summertime. So I've got to do that today. i got to film a video. Mom and I are going to Walmart. Oh, it's going to be a, it's going to be a busy day. I'm a different person. I, that was the most magical thing ever. He is, he told me he was, what's it called? Like a, a bone mover? Is that what the name is? I can't think of it. But he like pressed on my legs and I've never, I've only ever been to chiropractors who like, they only dealt with your back. And like they would maybe mess with your neck, but it was only your back. And that was like so different from any other experience I've ever had. And I immediately feel different. Oh my, and he actually told me, he was like, you're not stretching these two muscles correctly when you, he said, you work out. And I was like, yeah, and he goes, all right, let me show you two stretches. And he showed me two stretches, and as soon as he did it, my whole back, like it was my leg stretches, my whole back completely like released a lot of pressure, and he was like, see how much that better that feels? He was like, it's just things like that, people don't realize. And then, so it was two things in my legs that he showed me, and then he popped my hips, and he cracked my neck twice, and I know that that's kind of like a controversial thing with chiropractors. Literally as soon he touched it and he says that tender right there and I was like yeah and he goes all right Well, I'm gonna crack that and as soon as I crack that you will not have pain anymore And it was instant like as soon as he did it as Soon as he cracked my neck. I Immediately was like oh my gosh my back is better. Okay. Hold on. There's a couple Just went and took the PO box. I gotta tell you, it's pretty cool to see your daddy making his dreams come true. Um, my dad has been a, he's like side gig for years, remodeled homes, um, and then like flipped homes and stuff like that. But last year he got his contractor's license and he is building his first full from the ground up house this year and I actually put something about it on my Instagram stories yesterday so many of you were like that's so cool and I was like I know it's like it's not every day you get to watch your dad's dreams come true um so we went after everyone was done with work I don't know it's just really awesome but now I've got to go home and I have to give the whole reason I brought that up is because I forgot that I like just gave him one of the keys to my PO box and I was like here just have all your stuff shipped there like so you're not having to give like people your home address um and so he uses the PO box for his construction stuff as well so now I am going to take the truck home and give him his piece of mail excitedly because it has like his little business name on it it's really cool
All right, so I'll walk you through kind of what we got real quick. It's not super organized, but we got onions, brown rice. I've been eating a lot of this because it's a lot better for you than white rice. Asparagus. Finally got a rice strainer. I don't have to like rig one up um, because the rice is actually a lot better if you rinse it first. It's like not as sticky. Um, bananas, those are for my protein shakes in the morning. More asparagus, soap, taco seasoning because I have a really good recipe. Um, you can find it on my Instagram of like chicken taco bowls that I make in the Instant Pot. So you need taco seasoning. And I also got mushrooms for that. Sam's lunch meat for that. Um, this is for my shakes in the morning. I make it with this stuff, the super greens. It's really, really good. Tastes really good. Um, cheese. This is also for Sam's um, sandwiches. More cheese there because the boy eats a lot and so does Doug. We like put some of like Doug's um, medicine in here. So we've got a bunch of frozen broccoli because I like, actually I'll put that over there for a second. But this is some of the stuff I need to make that dump cake. I don't know if I told you guys about it. I'm making a um, recipe that Caitlin Covington shared. It's like a pineapple cherry dump cake and you need yellow cake mix and butter. I got more dry shampoo. This is my favorite brand of all time, Batiste. And then these are our really good scent pods. We love, love these. Our laundry. This is all of the fruit for tomorrow at the lake. I also got some apples because I like to snack on them. Like I said, I already really liked these and then you guys told me to try these. So I got these because I eat them at um, work. Like in the morning when I'm intermittent fasting, right as it hits about 12 o'clock or even sometimes before then, if I like absolutely won't be able to make it till 12, I'll eat one of those. So we like the steamed green beans, broccoli. And then I got, um, let's see, pork chops or pork loins, I don't quite know, um, chicken breasts. Then I've got steaks. And I really, really like steak, as you guys know. And then I also got, oh, let's see, these are some Italian style pork meatballs and then sirloin tender steak. Um, and then a bunch of like black beans, seasoning. This is what we need to make the dump cake, the crushed pineapple. And then also the cherry pie filling. Got some eggs, unsweetened milk. Oh, I forgot to get half and half. Are you freaking kidding me? I forgot to get half and half. <sighs> Alfred is awesome. And just this is like lunch over here. All right, so now I'm gonna clean up the, my back's hurting a little bit. He told me this would happen. Like my left leg has been tingly for a while. Um, he told me my back would still probably hurt a little bit until the end of the day and if it continues on just just like come back and see him early next week but I mean obviously I didn't think it was like a one-time fix-all I just knew it would feel better and it feels so much better but it does stop a little bit of tenderness so okay got a lot to do I've been out of the bed for two seconds what are you doing don't give me that Sarah I've been out of the bed for like two seconds, you sweet boy. Okay, good morning everyone. So, it is officially July 4th, one of my favorite holidays, because it was this day five years ago I told Sam I loved him for the first time, and instead of saying it back, he looked at me and said, you beat me to it, I was just about to say that. So, um, and the fireworks were like going off in the background. It was really sweet. So July 4th is one of my favorite holidays ever. Okay, so I've got to make coffee. And then I need to make this dump cake um, that Caitlin Covington shared. I'm going to cut a pineapple and kind of clean up the house a little bit. And that's really it. So not a lot to do this morning. I prepped last night. <laughs>
Okay, so we're getting ready to go to the lake and I asked Sam to put his laundry up and he saw, he's mad. You mad? Nope. But? Nope. No but. No? Nope. And you're just getting rid of stuff tomorrow. No! He's mad because, like, I had to take her. But, like, here's the thing. He has the big, like, these are so much bigger than these. But these show in the pictures. So it's like a vibe, you know? No, I don't know. Well, I'm not getting rid of anything. Look at this. You don't need your stuff crammed on top of it. So no, you but you have so much room. Like, I, I, I'm taking up. Like, like. So what, you want me to put all my shirts in this one? So you can have a whole other full one? No. But I'm saying you need to learn to share. Sharing is caring. You have the, both tops. You have the drawers. You have the tops have too. Two thirds, if not three fourths of that bottom <laughs> down there. That's all of the pants racks, but one. <laughs> That's because you fold your pants. Don't make this about me. You fold your pants. You have all of these except for this, this one, this one, and then this one. So I have three. You have the other seven. I got a lot of shit, Sam. Okay. Mhm. Mm wow. Well. Your pants are always falling on my shoes. Your life's hard. It is. Miserable. You got a jacket in here? There's a dang hoodie in here. Why is that in there? What? Whatever this is. Those are pants. It's touching my Sam, these are literally joggers, honey. Lord, no. You're gonna stop now. I'm trying to figure out which pair of pants this is that's touching my shoes. Why, why can't they touch your shoes? Because they're gonna smell bad. Your pants will smell bad, not my shoes. Okay. <laughs> Why, 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 why do you need to be under my feet all the time? You are huh? difficult, why? mister. Why do you gotta keep setting up shop underneath me? Because he loves you. Oh, that was sweet. I got that on camera. My dog, are you excited to go to the lake today? I know. I'm gonna get reported for animal abuse for fattening him up. <laughs> What's all that? He is the happiest dog that? ever. Got... Look at the way he's like <laughs> looking at you. He's that? like, this is my daddy. <gasps> dog. Is daddy making fun of you? you roll over there, roll over there. You tell him that you are perfect the way you are. Yeah. Say, I'm chunky and it's perfect. Look at all these little spots showing up. Butt breath is what you got. His like spots are getting so much darker the older he gets. Right, dog? Oh yeah, sorry, dad's leaving. Gotta go follow him around a little bit longer. <laughs> Look at your little tail. You so excited to go to the lake today? You gonna go swimming? Hello everyone. So I never <laughs> actually do these anymore. <laughs> Hello everyone. I'm still camera shy. So we've been at the lake all day. Been all day, I mean literally for like the last seven, eight hours oh, yeah, all day. Sure. And we took, took this guy back here today <laughs> and we came back with a lot more than we took. We only had one of these coolers. Long story short, we, we brought back extra from most parents. And he is about to fall asleep. And he has been trying to figure out how to lay down in that one seat for like the last 20 minutes. And he just, it, he's pitiful. He keeps putting his head on the cooler. He puts his head on the door. Every, so every time he like gets comfortable, he stops. Because we hit a bump. Or the wind goes. Wrote. I'm paying attention. He's just so dang cute. I can't even. But like, you can see it on his face. Like he, he like in so the reflection, old. his eyes are barely staying open. <laughs> he is so tired. But uh, yeah. So. Put it on me. Guaranteed, when we get home, he is falling asleep and he is not moving the rest of the day. In other news, we had so much fun. I oh look, no take. Put it look over there. That way. We uh, in other news, I had so much fun. I completely forgot to vlog. Not a single thing. Left the camera in the car and I kept like, God, I need to go get the camera. That's how it always is. Like, I am having so much fun with family that I forget to take the vlog camera out, but. Granted, this is the first time that we've been able to go and see yeah. Mariah's grandparents. Probably since, since February. Yeah. I think we went and had dinner with them in February. Jan and January. 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 January or February, we went and had dinner with them. Um, Having no idea that that was going to yeah, be Yeah, just like this was just to go have dinner with them. And then the shutdown, the, the shutdown was like the following 
two weeks later they started yeah. shutting stuff down. So and, and they're their they're age. both yeah they're both older, retired, and so they've been quarantining themselves just like since March first. Like precautionary. They've got the church they go to. The people have been hooking them up, bringing groceries, and like like they have not left their house or went anywhere in yeah. probably almost three months at this point. So. It was good to get to see him for sure. Oh, it was so good. Yeah, look at that precious. Oh, there we go. He figured it out. He figured it he out. Figured it out. They can't stretch out in the back seat. He's you want us to salute? He's pouting. We're gonna yeah. we're gonna turn this off and be quiet. We're so he can almost sleep there, now. dog. We're almost home.